you know, I had definitely the worst uh, time in my life uh, at, at this period, let's say, at this uh, weeks before the Grand Prix. And um, everybody, really everybody, told me not to go to the race because it's just not just not ready physically because I was in hospital and I still been in heavy antibiotic infusions and uh, mentally because I lost three days before my father on the plane crash and uh, just and and I had a big fight with Flavio at the time in the team so the team was against me the the emotion with the father was against me and uh, and and the health was against me so everybody says to me what you're doing here in Hockenheim and I, I remember everybody had a kind of Chinese smile on it and say you're so happy that you are back but everybody says well I thought I could read in the face you know what you're doing here. and I think that's that's what gave me the the bush you know I just say well fuck it you know and I remember I just went to a press conference told without anybody telling before thought that I kind of stop this to try for Renault or Benetton at the time and I just went into the car and I just said well let's see what we, what we can do but at the same time it showed me how much it is mental you know and it showed me that uh, I mean we always uh, aired on with such a strong performance and I always could see that his strength was mental or one of his strengths was mental but my race in Hockenheim the 97 race was so much more proof for me that is so much coming from the head that the day when I have to judge a driver I, I would very much look into his mental uh, situation, mental approach because it's it's a lot. Do you have to be in a situation where there's just nothing to lose and just go for it to really produce the natural yeah, kind of I ability? Mean, it looked like on my case was like this but what you want is somebody what has always this situation whether you know he, he, you look for somebody not he has nothing to lose. Uh, you, you, you look at somebody what can also get this uh, performance out of himself every day on, on every kind of conditions. Me, it made me the most difficult condition, made my body uh, exploring more energy than, than, than ever before. And I don't know if I wouldn't have all this shit. You know, if my father wouldn't have this, I wouldn't mm -hmm. be in the husband. I would come to Hockenheim and everybody would say, great that you're here and yeah. fantastic, another race, you know. And maybe I would finish sort of fourth, you know, I don't know. And even the car wasn't at the time a real super quick car, mm -hmm. you know. I mean, we, 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 it's the only race we won or the team won until this time. So, when you look into Formula 1, into these 24 cars, everybody would make his way into Formula 1 has a good performance. You, you, as a driver, you don't get there. But then in the in Formula One, there's again a quite a big difference. And today I would say one of the biggest things what the driver has to have next to his natural talent is the mental strength.